Complete training is available at itdvds.com. Microsoft Windows Server Update Services 3.0 with Service Pack 2 allows us to manage all of our updates for all of our Windows clients, whether they be desktop or server. Not only does it allow us to manage our Windows updates, but we can manage our Microsoft Office updates, our SQL Server updates, our Exchange updates, and a whole lot more. It allows us to approve specific updates and apply those updates to our clients at scheduled times. And then gives us the ability to run reports against our clients and our updates to see what updates are needed and what clients have specific updates applied to them. And the good news is Windows Server Update Services is free. And it truly is a great tool. In this training, we're going to go over not only how to set it up, but how to set it up in a real world scenario where we have test servers, dev servers, production servers, clustered SQL servers, desktops, and desktops and servers in multiple locations. We're going to go over how to set up multiple Windows Server Update Services servers in those remote locations for replicas, for centralized management, and also downstream servers for distributed management if we have administrators in our remote locations. We're going to go over best practices and how to organize your updates in a tiered structure so that the updates are properly tested before they're sent to production and a whole lot more. So let's get started.